वेलकम फ्रेंड्स लेट एस सॉल्व द फर्स्ट पार्ट ऑफ क्वेश्चन नंबर टू ऑफ एक्सरसाइज टू पॉइंट थ्री ऑफ चैप्टर टू एंड द क्वेश्चन सेज चेक वेदर द फर्स्ट फॉलिनोमियल इज ए फैक्टर ऑफ द सेकेंड फॉलिनोमियल बाय डिवाइडिंग द सेकेंड फॉलिनोमियल बाय द फर्स्ट फॉलिनोमियल सो दिस इज द फर्स्ट पार्ट ऑफ द क्वेश्चन नंबर टू ऑफ एक्सरसाइज टू पॉइंट थ्री एंड हियर वी हैव टू डिवाइड द सेकेंड फॉलिनोमियल बाय द फर्स्ट फॉलिनोमियल दिस मीन्स सेकेंड फॉलिनोमियल इज डिविडेंड एंड द फर्स्ट फॉलिनोमियल इज द डिवाइजर सो लेट एस सी हाउ टू डू इट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी शेल राइट द डिविडेंड हियर एंड दैट इज फोर टी रेस टू द फोर्थ पावर प्लस थ्री टी क्यूब माइनस टू टी स्क्वेर माइनस नाइन टी माइनस ट्वेल्व एंड वी हैव टू डिवाइड दिस फॉलिनोमियल बाय टी स्क्वेर माइनस थ्री सो लेट अस स्टार्ट first of all we shall find the first term of the quotient and to do that we have to divide the first term of the div dividend that is 2t raised to the fourth power by the first term of the divisor that is t square then we have 2t square so the first term in the quotient is 2t square and now we shall multiply both the terms of the divisor by 2t square then we have 2t raised to the fourth power and minus 6t square and now we shall change the sign of these terms it will be negative 2t raised to the fourth power it will be positive t 6t square and these two terms will be cancelled out here we have we shall brought down 3t cube here it will be 4t square if we subtract minus 2t square from 6t square here we have 9t Minus twelve. We have brought down these two terms here, and now we shall find the next term in the quotient by dividing three t is cube by t is square. Then we have three t. This means the next term in the quotient is positive three t, and now we shall multiply three t with t square minus three. Then we have three t. Cube minus nine t, and now we shall change the sign of these terms. Here will be minus three t cube. Here will be positive nine t. Then these two terms will be cancelled out, and now we have four t square minus twelve. And now to find the next term in the quotient we shall divide 4t square by t square then we have 4 therefore the next term in the quotient is positive 4 and if we multiply 4 by t square minus 3 we have 4t square minus 12 and if we subtract 4t square minus 12 from 4t square minus 12 then we have 0 these two terms will be cancelled out and we observe here that the remainder is zero therefore first polynomial is a factor of the second polynomial
so this is the solution of the question thank you